Jordan. We have team coverage at noon on the weather with crews in both Broward and Miami-Dade counties. That's right. Let's go now to local 10 news reporter Annalise Garcia live in Fort Lauderdale for us this afternoon. Annalise. Hey ladies, so we have been across the beach area here in Fort Lauderdale. We started over in Hollywood and all we've really experienced all morning are these heavy winds that you're seeing out here. Not a lot of rain, but every street throughout Broward County is pretty gloomy. So we're all experiencing the same thing. But as you get closer to the water, you can see how intense it is out here, how these waves are crashing. There's not a soul on the beach right now. Definitely not a good day to be out here. The only people I've seen out here is this one kite surfer out here. Uh, definitely probably not the safest thing to be doing right now, uh, but as I mentioned, not a lot of rain, just a lot of gusts, heavy gusts of wind. We do know that over in Hollywood Beach, they uh, the lifeguards were putting out their red flags to warn beachgoers of the rip currents this morning. Rough seas off Fort Lauderdale Beach and Hollywood Beach as strong gusts of wind churn up the Atlantic. Crews standing guard ahead of what's in the forecast. Let's rock and roll, bro. I'm ready. The city of Fort Lauderdale telling us a flood watch is in effect through Thursday at 7 p.m. City officials say wind gusts up to 40 miles per hour are possible. They're encouraging residents to take in any items from their yards that could be blown away, including those inflatable holiday decorations. It was like riding my bike through the snowstorm, except for it was sand. City crews placed these flood barriers along the beach wall openings to prevent storm surge and sand from washing into nearby hotels and businesses. City officials in Hollywood Beach lifting fees at some parking garages, allowing residents to find higher ground for their vehicles as conditions worsen. We saw them putting the barricades up yesterday and we knew it was going to be not beach weather. Back out live here taking another look at these uh, trees blowing in the wind. Again, very, very aggressive winds out here for Lauderdale. City officials were telling us that it could go up to at 40 miles per hour. Uh, you're going to learn more of that back at the studio with our weather folks. But uh, we do know that also city officials here in Fort Lauderdale and Hollywood were making sure that they had extra barricades in case that there were any areas with heavy flooding. Uh, we also know that over in Hollywood, uh, if you are need to park your car at a higher level, they will keep those parking garages open. You just need to prove that you're a resident. We are live in Fort Lauderdale Beach. Annalise Garcia, Local 10 News.